Hey, what's up, guys? Frank here, and today I wanted to show you how I how you can create uh, a lot of design very easily using the um, Merge Titan Canva tool. Okay, so basically this tool this tool I highly use it and I highly recommend it. And so this is the Canva Titan uh, tool. If you go on MergeTitan.com, it's the uh, Canva Titan automation. Okay. It basically it's uh, 10 USD dollars per month. It's a subscription, okay, and uh, it's worth it, okay. So uh, with this with this tool, you'll be able to create a lot of design very easily, and uh, I'll show you exactly uh, how I how I use it, okay. So basically, uh, first of all, you need to register an account with Merchitan, and once you register an account with Merchitan, you want to subscribe to this uh, to this tool to this service. Okay, and then once you do, you able you'll be able to uh, use the um, Merge Titan, the Canva Titan uh, tool, which is a Chrome extension. Okay, so you download and you you'll you'll also need to log in to the uh, to this tool. So right now I'm logged in I'm, uh, with my account, and so basically how, how it goes is uh, I'm actually going to create. Uh, a Canva with uh, the size that I usually do. So this, this is the, this is the design, the the size that I, I always create my design. So the the idea is with this tool is that you use is to use Excel sheets. It's, it's to use uh, CSV files using variables, and with these variables, you're able to change the value of the variables. To the thing that you want, okay. So, for example, like uh, I'm just gonna, I have this list of variables. So, for example, let's take uh, this one, okay, age.csv. And so this, this, uh, this list, I use it to uh, create a bird. Usually, it's it's birthday design, okay. So it's basically a list, okay. As you can see, variable one. It's the the var. It will in the design when you put variable one, it will search for this column, and then when you download the design, it will create uh, the file name uh, of the design using uh, this column here. Okay, so basically this uh, this list goes to fifty, and basically what I do is that I'm just gonna show you right here what it does. Okay, so I'm gonna simply create. It's a, you just create a text a text field. And uh, in it, you uh, you write var one, and so basically you want var one in majuscules, okay, in I in I caps. You want var one to fit with the variable here, okay. So you write var one, and then you go into this tool, you select the CSV. In this case, I want to select H to show you. And this this time I'm going to cycle to the variables. Okay, I'm not going to download anything. I just want to cycle to the variable to show you and to see if everything is right. Okay, so that's basically what it does. Like it simply cycles through the the column, the CSV file that you give it, and as you can see, it goes through the the, the list. And now I'm not downloading, but I could be downloading right now some designs. Okay, so. There's a lot of things you can do with it, and so basically right now I'm using my age CSV file. Okay, it goes through 50, and what you can do, for example, I'm just gonna create a very simple like, like just to show you an example of some design that you could be creating. Okay, so right now I'm just going to like create some designs, and I'm going simply going to do this okay i am variable one years old okay so that could be a design that you could be creating again like uh, it's a very simple design i don't i doubt that i'm going to actually use this, this these design but it's simply to show you okay so so again i'm going to select my uh hcsv list okay this time i'm going to dump no i'm going to cycle to the variable again just to show you so as you can see now, it says what I am, da 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 years old. Okay, so that that that's the goal. Like you wanna you want you wanna be able to automate as much as the as much design as possible. Okay, so 
there's a lot of things you can do with this tool, okay? And right now I'm doing like some kind of birthday designs, but you can like this tool is very powerful, okay? Like I I have a lot of lists here, and so I have let's say age CSV. You can like this is actually like this. These are lists that I took from somebody else. I think it was Ryan Hogg. Okay, if you don't know this YouTube channel, I highly recommend it. Like I I actually follow this YouTube uh, this YouTube channel. And so credit to him for these lists. Um, and uh, I also created my own list, and I modified. I also modified some lists in it. But you see, I the, the most list that I the list that I use the most is uh, age. I also use a lot names. Okay, it's a list of uh, you know most popular names. I use this list a lot. So basically, another thing that you could be doing. Okay. I'm going to uh, select this one. I let's say for example, like I'm going to create another sample design. Okay, I'm going to search for a set. Oh, I'm going to search for a heart. Like we often see these designs sometimes. I don't know. Like I'm going to select the names and then I'm going to cycle through it. So as you can see now it does like some kind of I love name. If that makes sense. Okay. So that's the idea. Okay. You you want to create lists of things that you can easily like change within the variable and then you you're you, you can be able to create a lot of design like this. Okay. So now what I'm going to do is I'm I'm going to uh, download some some examples, okay? So I'm simply going to create my var one thing, and then I'm going to say I am results. Okay, and so now I'm going to download really download uh, to see what happens. Okay, so this time I'm going to download. I want to I want to download as PNG because we always want the transparent background. It's really important. And then you just write the name of the folder that you want your design to be in. So this time I'm going to uh, I'm going to name the subfolder uh, years old black. I put black because Again, like I always put my, I always done, I always do my design in black, and I also do my design in white. Okay, so right now I'm doing the black design, but once I have done all the black design, and like I done all the black design, what I usually do is that I will simply change the color, and then I will do simply white design. Okay, right now it's in black. I will also do white design. So I'm just gonna do the same thing that I'm doing now, but also with the white design. Okay. So now I'm going to download this. So I'm going to submit, and now it's going to download. It's going to start downloading. So now it says, I am one years old. So an important thing when you're using this tool is that you don't want, you, you want to, like, once, once it, when it's downloading, you, you don't want to, like, mess up with the download, okay? So what I usually do is that I just let the thing download, okay? As you can see right now, I'm not doing anything. It's downloading, okay? But, like, if you start changing window or you do other, st other stuff in the computer, it can, it can mess up the download, okay? So what I usually do is that once it's downloading, I usually do other stuff, okay? You can go grab a coffee or you can do something else, okay? Because if you do, like, let's say, change window or... Like you start doing other things on the computer, sometimes it will mess up with the download. So I just make sure that I don't touch anything so that it doesn't mess up anything. All right, so as you can see right now, the download just finished. So it created and downloaded uh, 50 designs. I am variable one years old. And it also has transparent background. So as you can see, like, We'll see the results here, okay? So let's go in my download folder, okay? So in my download folder, it created this folder here. And as you can see, like, it created 50 designs with I am, ta-ta-ta, years old, 
and that's that's what it does okay so it created 50 designs black design and so what I usually do from now on is that I simply change the color because uh, you know like you want to also create white designs okay so what I usually do is that I do this basically the same thing but I simply change the color okay so now now so if you notice uh, with the first with the first cycle I created a years old black design so now I'm simply going to create a folder named white years old white design okay so I do this just do the same thing and so now it's gonna it's gonna download again for maybe five minutes and so we'll see again we'll see each other again in five minutes okay okay so as you can see now the white design just finished so now let's see the result okay so again I'm just gonna go in my download folder now we have two subfolder okay so the first thing that we did is the black design and now we also have the the white designs okay so again we also want the transparent background because it's important in the print on demand business to have the transparent background so that's basically what it is like in maybe 10 minutes may I've done like 100 design and those would be ready to be used okay so I'm not really going to use them because I was simply creating creating an example for for this video but you get the idea okay my goal is simply to show you the power of this tool and now I also want to show you one last thing okay uh, and uh, it's uh, I showed you one variable but you can also uh, create design with multiple variables okay for example one list that I use is years and age okay so basically in this case there are two variables okay so Maybe this list is a little bit outdated right now, as you can see, because, uh, you know, like uh, right now it doesn't make sense, like uh, 2019 and then one year old doesn't make sense, okay? But, uh, you know, I just want to show you anyway. So in this case, we have two variables. So the first variable would be uh, like uh, the year that I was born. And then the second variable too would be the, my actual age okay so in this example like the the file is probably a little bit outdated but I'm gonna show you anyway so right now I have this design okay that we already created I am variable one years old but now I'm going to uh, make that could be other design that you create okay so I am and now I'm just simply going to write I was born in I'm gonna reduce the size a little bit to make it on the line so I was born in and then I'm going to add a second variable okay but instead of variable one I'm gonna add a second variable it was my bad it should be variable two here and variable one oh. okay so let's try again so again I'm going to select years and age let's go and now it says I am da, 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 years old I was born and now you have the variable of the year okay so you can actually use multiple variables in the same design and then you can make multiple designs like this okay and now I'm not downloading these designs but that's something that I that I could be doing okay like uh, I am da, 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 years old I was born and now you have the year so this is some example this is some examples with two variables but now maybe you could be creating like three variables maybe four variables with the kind of design that you want to create okay so so yeah that's pretty much I hope that I was able to show you how this tool is actually powerful and uh, how you can maybe use it to your advantage or whatever and so I really like this tool I use it a lot and uh, I, rec I recommend to use it if you're serious with, you, with your print-on-demand business and uh, that's it if you have any question let me know and I will make uh, the list available in the description okay so there you go peace